how to use google sites contact form hi guys welcome back today i'm going to be showing you how you can add a contact form to your google sites website so let's get started the process is super easy and you will be able to create a professional contact form in your website so what you have to do is simply open up sites.google.com and this is where you will land um if you want to access google sites uh, you know directly then you can simply go to your drive and in your drive you will simply go to new in new go to more and then you will find google sites right here once you are on google sites then you will be able to create a new website i'm gonna go ahead and quickly open up my website where i want to add the contact form to similarly you will also open up your google sites website where you want to add the contact form and then you will be able to add it so this is my website right here it's a demo website that i created now what i want you to do is simply go to pages and in pages we have home right here we need to add a new page so simply click on new give your page a name and, and the page name is going to be contact there you go simply click on done and a new page is created you can see right here it will be added in the navigation of the website as well this is my page contact and i want to add a contact form to this page right here now simply go to insert in insert if you scroll down you will find forms right here simply click on forms now it will open up your google forms for you and you will be able to access the forms that you have created on google forms and you have to create a contact form right here so what you have to do is simply open up your google forms docs.google.com you can also access your forms open up your drive go to new and google forms is available right here once you open up your google forms in here you have to create a contact form first so instead of going and creating a brand new contact form you can go with this template right here which is contact information select this one and now we have our contact form right here i can go ahead and customize it the way i want to in this contact information we are getting name email address phone number and comments so if you want to you know edit it out if you want to kind of like change it then you can go ahead and do that you can also add different questions whatever contact form you wanted to create you can simply go ahead and do that for example i can click on add and then i can add a new question right here and it, it is going to be a multiple choice it can be a tick box linear scale or maybe i can upload a file from my computer as well Similarly, we can edit the text, we can add images, videos, and we can add a section too. So for now, I'm not going to add any question. We have name and then we have email. If you want to add a new section, you will click on new section. And I can simply go ahead and create a new section as well. Let's say that I can create a section for personal information and then I can add a section for maybe international information. So this is how we simply add different sections. We can also import questions if we want to. If you already have created questions, if you have already created a form and it has some questions, you can add them as well. So once you've added all of the information right here, you have created sections, you have created or added all the information. So once you have created the form, you can see that we also have responses option right here and we have settings so where i will add this form i will be able to check the responses right here in my google forms we can also change the color and appearance for our form if we want to for example i can you know customize the section color and everything you can see right here now it's kind of like this so whatever color you want to go for you can select and you, you can customize it the way you want to once you're done you will simply save it once it's saved then we will simply go back to our site right here and now if i go again to insert and forms it will open up the form that i have created just now you can see this is our contact form simply select it click on insert and it will be added right here there you go this is our contact form that i just added now 
simply move it and place it wherever you want to like i can actually place it in the middle i can actually you know change the color and then of course we can do different settings here in the website as well for example changing the section color or maybe adding a text too so this is a contact form right here if you can actually customize it the way you want to wherever you want to place it this is going to be our contact page and it has this contact form that i just created you can of course customize and create more professional like this is the most simple one you can also you know add different sections and create a complicated contact form as well now i can simply go ahead and add a button too so i'm gonna actually go ahead and add a button so i have added the name of the button as submit and in the link i am actually going with my google forms so that i can get the responses right here so you can simply go to your contact again and go to and get your own link once you have the link then i will simply go back to my page this is completely optional i am just adding it right here this is not necessary if you do not want to add a button you can just leave it and but i am just gonna add like let's add home maybe and you will simply you know add it right here wherever you want to place it add the button and add it after that there will be a submit button as well but this is completely optional all you have to do is just simply create your contact form add it into your website click on publish and your website will be published and now my website has a home page and a contact page and a contact page has its own contact form so once your contact is created then we can also you know change the layout if you want to you know select this layout then you can simply go ahead and add different you know sections to your website as well and then we can insert different images let's go ahead and change the background color for this section right here which is our contact section i will go with an image and i will select one from the library available this helps us you know get an aesthetically pleasing section and people are attractive towards it but if you want to stay super professional you, you can go with a simple color too so i will simply go ahead and select this image right here and i will click on select and that image will be added right here you can see this is our background now and it looks pretty good and you can see it's making my contact form stand out Similarly, I can go with a nude color that will actually make my contact form stand out and people will be able to give all the information. You can also adjust the contact form if you do not want to create a new page and if you want to add a contact page to your home, then the process is going to be similar. Let's say that I want to add a contact form right here. I will go to insert, scroll down, forms. And we can actually create more than one form as well. So we have just created this contact form right here in our Google Forms. So that is why we only have one right here. But you can actually go to your Google Forms anytime during the creation of your website. And you can simply go ahead and create a new form. So let's say that I wanted to add this form right here in my home page. And I did not want it to create a new page. So I will simply select this one. And it will be added right here. There you go. And now again, I can adjust it wherever I want to. In order to delete the contact form, you can simply go ahead and remove it. Or you can open it up in a new tab. Let's remove this one. So this is how you simply can insert your form anywhere on your website. So yeah, guys, this brings us to the end of the video. I hope that I was a big help to you. And now you know how to create a contact form on Google Sites. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel.